is Ramrats and it's me Priska Joseph. Today we are discussing question number 3 from the exercise 1.1. So let's start. The question is find the LCM and HCF of the following integers by applying the prime factorization method. Here is a first question 12, 15 and 21. Factorization is already discussed in the last classes and let's start. 12 can be written as 2 times 6 2, 3. That is, factors of 12 is 2 square into 3. Okay. Then, factors of 50. 3 times 5. And it can be written as 3 into 5. Then, 21. 3 times 7. That is, Factors of 21 is 3 times 7. Factors of 15 is 3 times 5. And factors of 12, 2 square into 3. So, let's find out LCM. What is LCM? Product of greatest power of each prime factors of the numbers. Okay. So, here it is. 2 square into 3 into 5 into 7. <coughs> what is the answer? 4 into 3 into 5 into 7. Okay. So, this is equal to 4 times 3, 12, 12 times 5, 60. 60 times 7 is 420. So, this is LCM. Then what about HCF? HCF is the smallest power of each common factor involved in the numbers. Okay. What are, what are the common factors? Here is 3 is a common factor in all these 3 numbers. Okay. So HCF can be written as 3. So in this question LCM is 420 and HCF is 3. Okay. Hope you clear this question. <clears throat> okay, next one is 17, 23 and 29. See, all these three numbers are prime numbers. And we know that factors of prime numbers are 1 and the number itself. So, we can write 70 is equal to 1 into 70. Okay, then 23 is equal to 1 into 23. Then 29 is equal to 1 into 29. So, these are the factors of 17, 23 and 29. And now, what is LCM? LCM is equal to 17 into 23 into 29. Okay. So, 17 into 23 is equal to 7 to 14. So 391. Then into 29. 9 and 81. 35. Here it is 2. 18. 91. 3 to 6. 9. 3. 3. 11. So, LCM is 11,339. Okay. So, next one is HCF. What is HCF in this case? See, there are no common factors in all these three numbers. So, in such a case, we have considered HCF is equal to 1. If there is no any common factors... Then we take 1 as HCF. So, HCF is equal to 1. Okay. So, this is the answer. So, so the last one is 8, 9 and 25. So, let's factorize. 8 can be written as 2 to the power 3. And 9 can be written as 
3 to the power 2 and 25 is 5 to the power 2. Okay. So, what is LCM? Since there is no common factor, we have to multiply all these factors. That is 2 to the power 3 into 3 to the power 2 into 5 to the power 2. Okay. So, 8 into 9 into 25. That is 72 into 25. What is 72 into 25? That is 5 twos are 10, 36, 2 twos are 4, 10, which is equal to 1800. So, here the LCM is 1800. Then what is HCF? As we stated earlier, since there is no common factors, we take HCF as 1. HCF is equal to 1. So, this is the answer. So, LCM is 1800 and HCF Understand the question clearly and practice well. Okay. So, that's all for the day. Thank you.